Hey, my name is Steve, and I'm just going to show you. Um, I have a Dell Optiplex GX620. It's about 11 years old. And on it, I have um, OSX Yosemite 10.10.3. I may post directions. I've made videos or attempted uh, with terrible failure to uh, make videos for this, but. Uh, I will uh, maybe put this in the description, but we'll we'll show you this real quick. Here's your Dell Optiplex, right here. When the bootloader loads, I can actually push that and get an option to go to Windows or Yosemite. We're going to go ahead and just go to Yosemite. Oops, I did push the wrong button. What happens when you can't see because you're looking at a viewfinder? I think it takes 35, 40 seconds, something like that. Occasionally it'll take longer. That seemed, maybe it won't be so long this time. Um, occasionally it takes longer. I think if it's got some kex weird or it didn't get shut down right. And the video card that we're using on this is a... Um, it's an MSI GT610 2 gigabytes and um, you can see a wireless network utility here I have the TP-Link 723N um, and again if you look at the, uh, the display there it is NVIDIA GeForce GT610 and it's made by MSI. I have 4 gigs of RAM. Oops, that's the wrong thing, but anyway, that's my storage. It's a solid state drive. Very helpful. 4 gigs of RAM. Anyway, I don't even know what all this other stuff is, but um, but it works. And it, um, it works pretty well. Um, don't expect to play really awesome video games on it. You can get like, you know, Nintendo 64 and PlayStation emulators and things like that. Um, uh, but just, you know, don't don't plan, uh, you know, on playing uh, Grand Theft Auto 5 or, or, you know, something like that on it. Um, and it'll show you movies. I don't know if I've seen this movie. Anyway, so I just thought I would show you that this is um, It is working. You can watch movies on it. You can listen to music. I do all of my um, all of my writing on it. This looks like a really interesting movie. All right, folks. I suppose I could restart it and show you how it goes into um, Windows. So I'm booting it into Windows.
Anyway, that's all.